Um, okay, guys, so Hansen Grudel, Winch Hunters is another uh, German fairy tale story. Um, and this film is about um, a young uh, Hansel and Gretel. Um, they're like like little kids, and um, and they're all alone and stuff. And they enter this um, gingerbread um, house or whatever it's called. Um, and then crap starts happening. And there's there's this really creepy witch in there, and she tries to kidnap them. And then all of a sudden they just um, bring her down, pretty much, they, they kill the witch, and then later on, uh, when they grew up, um, uh, um, and then all of a sudden they grew up, and then all of a sudden they, uh, um, uh, um, oh yeah, okay, well, all of a sudden they grew up and they, um, become these really badass, uh, witch hunters, and they, and they hunt down witches and they kill them and stuff like that. And that's basically the plot of this movie. And uh, uh, my final thoughts on the movie... I think it could have been way better. And I, and I think it's a disappointment to me. I think it's really disappointing. Now, I can find enjoyment out of it, but I'm going to tell you why I didn't like this movie as much. Um... Well, there's so many things happening all at once, um, to the point where it's just um, a just a popcorn fun, mindless movie that doesn't hardly make any sense at all. And uh, there's like plot points that don't make a lot of sense, and there's like certain things that that would happen, and they wouldn't happen in the fairy tale story. And um, I just now find out this, um, yeah, but yeah. And I just now find out that this was actually a fairy tale. I never I knew about this fairy tale until I, I looked it up on Wikipedia, and, and then I found out from there. And this is a German kind of thing. But, um... But, yeah, but I, there are some positives I do like about this movie, and I'll get to that in just a second. Now, um, as far as the witches... Um, now, the witches' makeup... Uh, uh, they look okay, but they're not, uh, I, I mean, I'm not really a huge fan of witches too much, but they, these kind of witches are kind of like, they're kind of, um, they're kind of wannabes, if you would say. Um, but yeah, but like I said before, uh, yeah, I mean, there's certain things that, uh, yeah, that would happen that wouldn't necessarily, uh, make any sense or wouldn't happen in, um, I, I mean, in the fairy tale story. But, um, but yeah, um, I haven't, I, I, I mean, I didn't, like, like, I think it was a terrible, terrible movie, but I think that there's a lot of things that could have been uh, done way better. Yeah, yeah man, because, like, uh, I mean, this is not a perfect movie at all, definitely, but, um, yeah, but, yeah, but, but that's my main issue with the film, is that things... Are, 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 are well certain things that are happening um I, I, it's supposed to be a comedy also but i didn't really laugh at all there's a lot of f words in this movie i know and it is rated r and i, I guess it deserves the r rating because of the gore and the um language but overall um yeah but yeah guys man there are certain plot points like i said before that there's it just doesn't make any sense whatsoever. I mean, I mean, there's aspects where um, they're cool. I mean, they're fun to look at, but at the same time, they could have been done better, and they could have, um, uh, yeah. Another issue with this film is that it didn't have that much depth. It didn't have that much character um, depth. I didn't really know anything about any of these characters at all, especially, um, uh, Frankie Jimson's character, um, as the witch, uh, yeah, but Frankie Jimson, I thought, stole the whole movie, really, um, she was a good-looking witch, I will admit, and she was definitely hot in the movie, and, uh, and, uh, and, um, it also stars, um, uh, Jeremy Renner is also in this, he's, uh, he's right there, Jeremy Renner is in this, and um, I think her name is actually in real life. I can't remember this girl's name that plays uh, um, Griddle. 
or or either hand soap. I, I don't know which one's which, but yeah, tell me down below if yeah, um, yeah, which one's which, which one's griddle and which one's hand soap, because I don't know. But yeah, because I, I, there there were many things that that would happen. I don't remember um, much of them talking that much, but but yeah. Um, anyway, enough of that. Uh, Yeah, but this girl's name in real life. I think her name was a uh, um, uh, Gemma something Gemma um, um, Arcaten or, or whatever it's called. Uh, Gemma something. Yeah, it's, it's definitely Gemma. I know her first name's Gemma, but but I, I don't know how to pronounce her last name. But anyway, um, this movie it, it lacks on certain aspects. It definitely is a fun movie. For people that want to go into it with a, a a popcorn kind of thing, where you you go into the movies and you just want to have fun with it, I guess it's that kind of movie. But it just it lacks as far as story. I mean, it just it really really lacks some story, definitely, and character de depth and, and all that stuff. So um, with that in mind, um, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I mean, I can find enjoyment out of it, but it's very disappointing. So I'm going to give it a C minus because, uh, yeah, I can find a little bit of enjoyment out of it because of the gore and the language and stuff like that. But it's just not a very good movie, and it's not the best movie I've ever seen. So, and um, and there were things that um, that could have been done way better. I thought also. So yeah. Um, if you guys seen Hanson Griddle, let me know what you thought of it down below, and I will um, I'll talk to you guys next time. I won't be making any videos um, anytime soon right now because I have so much things to do and uh, family problems and stuff like that. So, yeah, until then, I will definitely see you guys when I see you. I, and I won't be on YouTube um, for a while either, and I won't be... Um, um, uh, watching any videos or anything like that on YouTube or anything like that for a while. So, yeah, I'm bare with that. I, um, it's going to be probably for like a week or two, maybe. And then I'll get back in my foot, start doing more. But for now, guys, um, I, I will see you guys in my next review when I do one again. So, yeah, um, that's about it. And I'll definitely... See you guys in the next one. So see you later.